The gap between housing demand and housing supply in the Commonwealth is one of the thorniest issues for state and local governments. Massachusetts is one of the most expensive states to find a home and it poses the most serious long-term hurdle to continued economic progress. The proposed legislation is part of our comprehensive strategy to build 135,000 new units of housing over the next seven years. The Housing Choices Bill before you offers a new approach to address that challenge by making it easier for local decision makers, city and town officials, to adopt best practice zoning policies that will facilitate substantial housing production across the Commonwealth. The Housing Choice Initiative creates incentives and provides resources to adopt planning policies that direct growth toward downtowns and transit-oriented locations. Our legislation encourages municipalities to protect undeveloped land by adopting best practices like cluster zoning and transfer of development rights. Uh, Massachusetts has had a long and proud tradition of local home rule, and the Baker Polito administration has a culture of respecting the role of municipal leaders in shaping their community's future. Housing, including multifamily housing, is a cornerstone of how we revitalize our downtowns, convert underutilized shopping centers, and build sustainable municipalities that are places where people want to live, work, and play. It is time to remove this barrier to the adoption of zoning changes that promote sustainable, appropriate, and much needed housing production. The Baker Polito housing plan allows cities and towns to adopt best practice zoning techniques by a majority vote of their legislative bodies. These best practices will facilitate diverse housing production they will revitalize our downtowns, and they will promote land conservation and environmental stewardship. In December, the Baker Polito administration announced the Housing Choice Initiative and filed an act to promote housing choices. We announced the goal of creating 135,000 housing units by 2025. It is important to set a target and then monitor progress, and we will do that. In fact, Working with Massachusetts Housing Partnership, we are working to improve housing data across the board. Housing Choice Municipalities will have exclusive access to a new state grant program that will make grants of up to $500,000 for local capital projects. As part of the initiative, we're streamlining access to technical assistance and adding resources for municipalities who want to plan for sustainable housing production.